So you have someone that can go up into the front I of personally the think so. Uh, I think they should run Invoker in the safe lane and then Timber in that mid lane. Uh, just so they... Got the Invis rune. Potential gank if he wants to go in towards the mid. He's only got level 2 with Return as well as Hope Stomp. But the stun may be enough for mid one to do some work with the sun strike. Yeah, he has the wave in a really good spot too. Like right outside his tower on the high ground. Koikva. Oh, there's your teleport. The sun strike's right in the mark. Spear is down for Koikva. He'll go down. The stomp from Cinderin just a little bit too late. Couldn't do enough damage. That was a great stomp though. He hit all three heroes with that. Yeah, um, it's, that's one of the toughest parts about playing a support next uh, okay, so at level 6. He's a little bit far up here. Syndrome's moving over, they got Wave of Terror, that's negative 3 on the armor. The Stomp is out, the Magic Missile is also available. Way too much damage for a Centaur to tank through. So Era will take the kill. Nether, nice, nice. Puppy's first movement. Pilot Eye is going to get the stun off, the Sun Strikes right in the mark and Syndrome. Food on the top rune. Then in other games, and he needs to be able to push the towers with the Bassy. Every little bit helps. Smoke gang going. Arnie could be caught out of position. The stun's out. The sun strike's coming in as well. Damage is already done, however, and Cinderin once again themselves onto this bottom lane with three heroes. Constantly really want to kill a pilot. Eye. Spirits out. A quick tether away, but the sun strike right in the money. Era, he's in trouble. Gets the sun over on Io. Able to get the kill. Three one charges are available. He's being body blocked up by Cinderin. Needs his space. Jukes it back down again. Getting the distance away from Puppy. Cindering close on his tail once again, starts up the stomp, but already the impaled damage from Puppy will find the kill on the safe lane core. Keizu's not done just yet, double edge is available, slice through Cinderin, one more slice will do it too. But MP's able to take away from Koifa. Yeah, they they have shut down pretty much every single stack. Look at Nyx's SM2 with his illusions, trying to go out what's going on over here. MP, his bottom lane, Centaur, there's a relocate coming in too, as MP, they're moving over towards Era, he has swap, he's trying to play the position, that's why he's throwing Keizu back in again, and the Sen, and the Stomp coming in, it's gonna hit, just as the chain was coming up from MP, the Syndrome with the Echo Stop will do the work, and Era may try and punish, Keizu able to be stunned up, there's a level 2 Frostbite available, and Syndrome, well, a couple of punches and Keizu should go down, Era will have the damage, they survive the relocate gank. Don't think Trixie will be as lucky, however. He's going to stick charge and try and surge out, but the Sun is going to hit its mark, or it would if MP already didn't find the kill. Both awesome. Arnie's coming out with four sentry wards, too. They planted one down, which Puppy, uh, they're just out of range of it. Now Puppy comes in range of it, so they can see Puppy. Quick crossfight. They'll spike Harris over on two. The Stomp from Elder Titan. They doesn't create any space. They lose two. They lose three so quickly, Team Secret. Pump out the damage. Ninja to pajamas didn't know what hit him. What a care base. They have no instant disable. Anyone that wants to disable him, I think the best one is probably Venge stun. But that has some travel time and he's stunned. They're sitting about 4k on the experience. NIP is still looking for these observer wards. But the sentries are out of range, so Puppy, well, Era saw him, the Sunstrike's gonna connect as well. They were putting themselves into this time, but Era, they need to get himself out. Where's the swap target? The fact the three-man wall with the ultimate is still not enough, they just stun. Io will fall, Puppy has to make a break for the tree lines. Maybe with MP being frostbitten up, Tibisaur can't keep his chase going, can't keep the damage going. Another spike character, but as it wears off, Arnie's frostbite can finally start doing the work. So much space created by Trixie. Now, Ninjas and Pajamas need to capitalize. The denial will probably want to give a little bit of respect. Hit one, okay, where's that stun? Dampede's gonna trigger as Puppy coming in through the rear. The ulti, let's go from Hani. Puppy will let out interrupted with that spy Carapace and the follow up stun, so Hani will go down quickly. This still was mid one. He was the first one being initiated on. Trixie now to dodge out the sun strike. Easy split up. Puppy again. This spy Carapace has done so much work. Entry one oh, place, Nyx. we understand what's going on, but uh... Nyx is looking for someone. They don't know where the Alchemist is, but he is going to show with the Observer Ward very, very soon on the left side. Puppy immediately heads over there. Here's the vision. Here comes the Alchemist, look for the fight, the sun strikes down, but it won't really hit on anybody. Sentry Ward's down too, they saw Puppy, they know he's behind the lines, he didn't range the other Sentry Ward, so they've got the stun, Spike Carapace is down, maybe they can actually remove the bug, but at the same time Trixie is 1v3, Puppy is still alive on 48 HP, a relocate coming in to save him part, I won't get there in time. It's still a 1 for 1 trade off the Dark Sea of the Nyx Assassin, are they having, having enough? No Koifa, he's going in, Pylai die, 3 seconds, 2 seconds, he's to get out with a relocate, he'll have the time, no he won't, he'll 
fall, but the trade-off is for the Vengeful Spirit. Quoifer still wants to keep fighting, but we'll watch him go one-on-one, or one-on-three with mid one, but he can't see him, so he can't attack him. Since Ring Wars down, Honey tries to create the space, but it's just not enough. Honey lets the ulti go, but the Yule steps the wrong hand do. He interrupts it instantly. Four heroes lost for Ninja Dipper Jarmans. And Syndrome is the only one that lives to tell the tale of why the 300 died on top lane. And, and they're and chasing I, it. To their dismay, there is no Roshan going on. They're searching up the Sentinel, who actually got body blocked by Koipa. Pylai dies, starts to TP, air out, they get the vision, they swap it back out again, so Pylai die. 301 gold for Hani for killing off an Io. He has a Midas on Io. <laughs> uh. If I remember correctly, after he got the Midas last time, uh, he built into a straight BKB. Koikva sneaking into Roach himself. Poppy is outside, but there There's is no a Aya. lot of minus armor. There's no Aya for 30 seconds. Invoker's there, though. And they just burned that Yule Scepter over on the Sentinel, so the Sharkin will fly in. Uh, where's your chemical rage, Koifa? He's getting stunned up inside the pit. He's gonna lose all of his mana and his life! FP! Shreds him apart! Trixie will try and turn around with a three-man wall, but there's just no fault. There's no extra control. The Lotus Orb reflecting the Sun of Era. The Sunstrike rides the money, so say goodbye to the Cross of Bane. The Splitter can do its work, but Puppy just uses it against Cinder and stuns him up with a Spire Carapace, and they'll move forward. Highlight A now relocates the front line. He'll support him up as well. No way to run for the big Elder Titan. With the three heroes again, it's going to be all five in just a second. And Ninjas in Pajamas, they have fortification. They can delay this a little bit. In fact, there is no wall available, so it's more of, just a, of a dissuading kind of thing. But Trixie's going to lose his life for a willy. Greaves as well as Sigchart to keep him alive. MP, his TP gets cancelled, so you'll have to go out the old-fashioned way. But the melee ranks is already taken. Concoction too far away, so Koifa ends up stunning himself as well as Sindra gets them together. And the Hawk stop catching out too. Here as well as Hani. That could be it. They've lost so much now with no buybacks available. Strixie will be brought down by the Timber. And Puppy's running back in again, looking for random things. How do you fight this? Team Secret can just go for the GG push if they want to. Or it can be safety by heading to the bottom. Nip just have no answer. And Koifa. Blink, Yule, Hawk. Try to dodge it with the Manta style, but there's just too much damage. Good game. Good well game, played. well played. 29, not even 29 minutes. The team Secret will take it with the same amount of kills. Solid performance. King. Al Alking.